What up, YouTube? This is John Snow speaking from John Snow Sports and Fitness, and today I'm going to answer an important email that I got. Title of the email it says right here, John, what are your thoughts on the current Washington Wizards and Chicago Bulls series? Do you think Nene was wrong with what he did to Jimmy Butler? Jason from Seattle, Washington. Okay, Jason, I'm going to answer your question. So be prepared and pay attention. Okay, let's start first with my thoughts on the series. This series has surprised me a lot. I really thought that Chicago would win in six games. It's still possible that they win in six games, but I think this gets series will go seven games now because I'm really impressed with the way the, the Washington Wizards guards have come of age. We all knew John Wall was a star, but Bradley Beal has really stepped it up in this series. He's really been playing well, and I've been really impressed with those two. Also, before he got suspended and ejected, Nene, Nene was dominating Joakim Noah. We all knew, I always knew Nene was good, but he's always had trouble with injuries. And this series has really surprised me. And Game 3 surprised me with, with Mike Dunleavy scoring 35 points. This guy averaged 11 points, 12 points through for the whole season per game. And then he just... He just came alive in the last game. He was making shot after shot after shot, and all his shots were in rhythm. Nothing was forced, and he scored 35 points. That really impressed me. And then Chicago played really good defense down the stretch, too. So those are my thoughts on, on the series so far. Now let's get to my thoughts on the Nene jimmy Butler incident. This... The the only problem I have with this is that Nene should have been a lot smarter. You got to understand when you're when you're a good player that teams are going to provoke you. They're going to try to get you ejected. It's called strategy. They want you to react. They want you to get mad and get angry. Don't give them the satisfaction. You can talk trash to them. You can do whatever you want, but don't don't use violence because you're going to get ejected and you're going to get suspended. And guess what? Nene's suspension impacted the game. As soon as he got ejected, the momentum just completely flipped for the Chicago Bulls. And then, now he's suspended for game four today. And once again, that's putting Chicago at a huge advantage. When you lose a starter and a starter in Nene's caliber, that's just going to put you in a significant hole. It was a big mistake by Nene, and he needs to be smarter than that. And I'll congratulate Jimmy Butler. Whenever you can provoke a star player and get them to come at you like that, that's a success because you know you're, they're going to get ejected. And if they get ejected, you've got a better chance to win. It's called strategy, folks. I don't knock Jimmy Butler. I, I celebrate what he did. That was a great decision to do that. He got him mad. He got him ejected. And his team won the game. And now Nene is suspended for game four today. So there you have it. Nene, I hope he learned from his mistake. It was a big one, really costly, really detrimental to his team. And next time, he needs to be smarter than that. Those are my thoughts. That answers your email question. This is John Snow from John Snow Sports and Fitness. Subscribe to the channel for the latest sports analysis, sports updates, fitness advice, fitness advice for athletes and anything related to sports and fitness. Diamonds are forever, and so is Jon Snow. This is Jon Snow speaking. Peace out.